All right, we continue along on Thursday, December 28th, the Pop-Tarts Bowl. I was waiting to see if Pop-Tarts would ever have a bowl name or have a bowl sponsored after them. It finally happened. Orlando, Florida, Pop-Tarts Bowl, Camping World Stadium, NC State, Kansas State. We've got uh, Kansas State three-point favorites, 47 uh, being the uh, total here in this game. Now, I think from a motivation standpoint, from what I see here in this game, I think both teams are into it. Um, so it's really, this is, I like to see that because, you know, it's one of those situations where I think uh, when you look at the uh, matchup here, you know, you got both teams wanting to play well, uh, and that's going to be interesting. Brennan Armstrong is going to start. He got his starting quarterback job back. MJ Morris is out of the picture. There are a few opt-outs. There's not a lot of impact starters on either side of the ball that are in the transfer portal uh, for NC State. Um, and it looks like there was some talk that one of their better linebackers might be out too, but he's kind of reneged on his stance that he may not play. Uh, and that's uh, Peyton Wilson for NC State, and it now looks like he might. So uh, that's good news for the Wolfpack. Will Howard went in the transfer portal for Kansas State, so Avery Johnson uh, now becomes the uh, quarterback. Uh, for the bowl game and moving forward for this program. Uh, so uh, Johnson takes over. Uh, you look at Johnson's numbers this year. He actually played quite well, 23 of 50, 35. He got into seven games this year for K-State, 65.7% completion rate, 301 passing yards, three touchdowns, no interceptions. So he actually played quite well. I don't mind actually one bit. Uh, Avery Johnson, you know, when he got the opportunity for K-State, played well. Uh, in uh, his opportunities. So uh, it's a fascinating bowl game here, and it's one that's, I think, tricky, tricky to bet because I think you see both teams with some incentive here. Uh, I don't see uh, massive motivational differences here uh, between uh, these two teams. I, I like both teams. I've made money with both of these teams throughout the course of the season, especially NC State down the stretch as they finished 5-0 and straight up, 5-0 and against the spread in their last five games. So... Uh, that's great momentum for them going into this bowl game. The one thing I do want to point out is NC State wrapped up the year with the win against North Carolina in the in the rivalry game. K-State wrapped up this regular season with a loss as a 10-point favorite at home against Iowa State. So, you know, was that the pinnacle of the season for NC State beating North Carolina and this bowl game is an afterthought? That is a concern in the back of my mind. Um, so it's a tricky game. I think above a field goal, I'd slightly lean to the NC State side. We've got NC State as a dog. Dave Dorn in the bowl games hasn't been that bad. You've got a defensive dot in their defense, which I thought was going to be down this year. Very, very impressed with what I saw from NC State's defense. And they actually played their best down the stretch where they ripped off that five-game win streak. So I lean NC State. Not sure if I'll get there with a bet on it, though. Uh, what do you think here, Connor? Pop-Tarts Bowl. Yeah, this should be... A pretty good one with uh, two teams that should be motivated, but there are some transfers, and this is one to go look at. I think K State a little bit more than NC State. You know what? In this game, man, I want NC State and Armstrong. It's crazy because I want to say I, I got to get he played well those last few games after game being benched and just looking awful um, all year long, and and the Morris just you know all of a sudden just leaving town, you know, just saying I'm out of here was, was real weird. And that defense, though, both these defenses are pretty good. K-State, I thought, you know, towards the end of the year, gave up some points. You talked about that last one to Iowa State, that last game. But I like the NC State team here. I like their defense. I'll take Armstrong. I think the, they could win outright, but I'll take the three and a half here. Three, try to get what you can, you know, shop around. 